Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're returning from another video, if you are new, hello, my name is Yanka. And for today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys some things I purchased from Pretty Little Thing. And everything I purchased from Pretty Little Thing kind of leads into fall, even though here in Arizona, it's gonna be hot for like two more months. But me personally, I don't mind it because I usually always just wear long sleeves, jeans, sweats. I always wear like longer stuff. I usually never wear stuff like this out in public unless I'm going out with my friends or on trips. That's the only time I wear stuff like this that's showing kind of more skin um, but summer literally happened and it's gone already two months felt like one month and yeah I didn't go out anywhere with my friends or trips I just stayed home but yeah guys like I said most of this stuff actually all of it it's more into fall it's nothing summer related but yeah let's just say goodbye to summer and let's get started with this video Okay guys, so I actually haven't even opened anything. I'm gonna open it with you guys. I'm so excited. There's like a hole. I don't know if I did that. Oh, my dog did that actually. Okay guys, so I'm gonna just lay everything out and let's start with bottoms. Let's start with bottoms. Okay guys, so for bottoms, you guys are gonna freaking kill me, but I ended up getting three pairs of sweats and they're all black. Just different styles. Um, let me tell you guys why. Don't judge me, okay? Um, I have no pair of black sweats. I bought one pair of black sweats a couple, like, months ago. Like, a couple months ago. And I made a video about it, but then deleted it. Um, but, yeah. I ended up buying some gray sweatpants. And they fit perfectly from Pretty Little Thing. But the black ones were too baggy. And it said, literally, like, baggy jogger sweats. But, um... Yeah, they were just too baggy and I don't wear them out in public because they're so baggy and I'm already short enough and it makes me look even shorter. So I ended up getting three pairs. Can I tell you guys something real quick? I've been wearing sweats everywhere, guys. By everywhere, I mean like the grocery store, um, when I see my boyfriend, when I go for a food run, when I'm at home. Literally, I've been wearing them everywhere and I've been getting... I just been having a new love for sweats. I swear guys, I never really owned sweats. I don't even think I think I owned one pair and they were like really tight, so they weren't really like joggers, you know? Um but yeah, I am in love with sweats and joggers. They're a new kind of love. And what's crazy is that I didn't realize because I've been wearing the gray sweats really for the last two months that I did not realize I gained a little bit of weight on my waist. Because I've been wearing sweats, I just didn't even notice. Until that denim haul I just did, like the last video I did a denim haul, I was like, oh my gosh, I had to suck it in a little bit because, um, yeah. But yeah, there's an addiction now because I'm even starting to think like, oh my god, I could wear these if I go out with my friends. I could wear these if I went to the movies. I could wear these for dinner. I could wear these anywhere. I just put a denim jacket over a hoodie and be like, oh, this is a fit. Like for winter, guys, I'm kind of scared because usually I always wear jeans. But I've been loving sweats that I might start wearing sweats forever. I don't know. But the first pair of sweats I got have a red stripe on them. Because the other two are just plain black. And I kind of wanted to spice it up a little bit. So I ended up getting these pair of sweats. They're literally called Black Slide Stripe Detail Joggers. So they're more jogger types. I personally like joggers better because I love that like cuffing at the... Um, end of your ankle and then when you wear like some sneakers it just looks so satisfying does anybody else get satisfied by ankles like when i see my own ankle i'm like oh my god that i just feel so attractive when i show my ankle is that weird i don't know okay so this is the first pair i got it in a size whoa oh my god that scared me it says uk8 and i thought i got usa8 I was like, what? Okay, so this is the first pair. This is size 4. And the only reason why I got it size 4 was because they ran out of size 2. I'm usually a 2, but this is the side. Actually, I didn't want gold detail. So it's red and it has a gold detailing. I don't know. Let's try it out. I'm going to put a clip right here of me trying, or right here somewhere, wherever there's more space. Um, I'm going to be showing you guys and trying it on so you guys can see how it actually looks on me. And yeah, so this is the first pair. How I said, I'm not a big fan of the gold detail. If it was all red, that's what I prefer. But we'll see when we try them on. Okay, guys, and then the next pair I got is all black. And these are similar to my gray ones. I think they're actually the same 
type just in black and i got them in size two what i loved about the gray ones it was like cuffed right here and didn't have the i think they're called drawstrings the strings that kind of like go like that i did not i mean i don't hate it but i prefer it not having them so this yeah it doesn't have it and then at the bottom it has the ankle cuff link. these are so comfortable and they're not um like really heavy like makes you sweaty material does that make sense but it's still thick it's not gonna be see-through so that's why i also like these joggers the gray ones they you can't see through them so the black ones obviously you're not gonna see through them at all but i like how it's not gonna make you like feel all sweaty yeah i'm gonna try them on i already know how they're gonna fit because i own these in gray okay then in the last pair of joggers but yeah same with this it has the cuffing and this has the drawstrings i hope that's what it's called because i've been saying that oh guys just so you know this has drawstrings but it doesn't do you know what i'm saying like, what's the point of this i don't know guys i'll try them all so you guys can see how they look i like them so far i just don't get the point of this like don't have it there if it's not gonna scrunch it but yeah Okay hey guys, so the first tie-dye shirt, it's a crop top. This one I got in a size 6. Oh, it's UK again. Guys, I'm like tripping, but no, I did not get UK 6. I got USA 2. So size 2, and it's a crop top, and it's tie-dye. Wow, it looks super bright in the camera. Um, I like that it's like cuffed because sometimes these tops, they come out like this. It's long sleeve. Like I said, let me try it on. I already know what outfit I'm going to wear with it. Like, when I got this, I was like, I know what jeans I'm going to wear. Like, I already know. Okay, and next, it's a size 2 as well. And this material is actually the same material as the other one. It's ribbed. I don't know if you guys could tell. Yep, it's ribbed. It's like those little lines. Actually, it's um, a really fresh cooling material. So, I'm actually glad because that means I can wear this and not be all sweaty and like, ugh. But yes, this the color you see is the color you're getting, guys. This one is not a crop top. It's like right to your waist. So I still would wear high-waisted jeans, me personally. But it's how it looks. Oh. Like this is so out of my comfort zone. I do not own anything like this. If you guys know me, you know I have like 10, 20 shirts, all black. That's all I wear. I wear all black. I was going to wear all black today. Guys, I got a blazer. I don't know. I don't know if you guys are thinking, what the heck, Yanka? Why are you getting a blazer in August? Oh, it's wrinkled. I don't know why I expected it not to be wrinkled, but it's wrinkled. Well, my coworkers would know. My blazers are not ironed. Or I don't even know what you do with blazers. Like, do you iron it? Because mine's do not look good because they were ironed. This is how it looks. In the inside, you know, that shiny wrinkle. And then the outside the color i don't know what to show you guys like it's just a blazer so when i wanted to get this blazer the reason why was because i was like okay i want a blazer that i could wear in fall not in winter because in winter i have a black coat i could wear a black coat for that but i wanted this blazer because i just had the vision it's not a vision i made up it's literally like everywhere on the internet um people wear it all the time but a t-shirt dress the blazer that's right where the t-shirt dress is at and my Doc Martens with my hair in a bun and that's it that's the fit like it's super casual but not because I put a blazer on does that make sense and there's also um other visions I'm gonna put them up here pretty much the main focus of this vision is I wanted to make a casual outfit not so casual with the blazer um, but yeah overall I think everything came out perfect Okay guys, so that's everything I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys enjoyed this make sure to like, comment. If you want to see more of me, make sure to also subscribe. But yeah guys, thank you so much for watching this and I'll see you guys next time.